when your malpractice carrier offers to do a full and comprehensive evaluation to help you find vulnerable areas or weak areas in your practice that could possibly open you up to legal uh, issues. And it's going to be free and it's going to be done by a professional. We felt we had no choice. We had to listen up and listen and that's what we did. I came to Dr. Abernathy's office and did a comprehensive assessment to identify gaps in patient safety protocols. The staff was encouraged to be open and honest during the process. The information was being collected to improve their procedures, not to punish staff for current processes. The beauty of the uh, consultant that came in is she examined everything we did and asked us the questions that we had not even thought about in our practice where we could mitigate risk. And we were doing some things that would open us up to risk and we didn't realize that. And she helped us understand that and change that. After the assessment, I had several data-driven recommendations for improvement in the practice, many relating to their communication and EHR system. We changed our protocols, we changed our policies, we changed all of our forms. Uh, we established a parents' advisory council so that we would have input from the parents. Uh, we added the clear triage uh, phone call system so that we could document and record the phone calls. And then at the end of the phone call, the nurse or the doctor who was taking the phone call could transmit to the patient what we said and any directions we gave. We increased our meetings with our staff, uh, nurses, doctors, receptionists. We increased our all staff meetings to twice a year. Uh, we changed pretty much everything. As you well know, change is hard, but we put the changes in place. We had our established protocols, our rules, and how we were going to do things. And the interesting thing happened. Staff came to me and said that their confidence in their jobs had increased. Providers came to me and stated that their job satisfaction had increased and that it was better. What happened was when we gave them protocols and a roadmap to do their job, at the end of the day, they were assured that they had not missed anything, that everything had been accomplished, and that the care was actually better because they had followed that roadmap. The Practice Risk Insight Service gave us the opportunity to change everything, and we did.